Yes. I'm looking happy to do. Do my sharing. No, I'm okay. I'm fine. Talk to me. Is it about your wife? What? Is it about your wife? Have I not told you to stop talking about my wife? She is not your business. I'm your business. Come on. I'm just showing you concern. I appreciate your, your concern, but please do not meddle in my personal affairs. My wife is my wife. Okay, what you and I have going has nothing to do with my wife. Don't, don't, don't do that next time. Okay, fine, fine. Uh, are we seeing next week? I will uh, let you know what my schedule is. I can then. Um, I'll also transfer something to your account. Something for the weekend. All right? What's wrong with this guy? Whatever. Why are you just looking at me like you don't understand what I'm saying? Ma, we are confused. We don't think any of that is our business. Not like we don't care about our friend. But we are not supposed to be interfering in our private life. Mm, no, no, ma, I disagree with you on this. Cindy is our friend and we should be able to tell her the truth when she's misbehaving. Mama is right. I don't want you girls to get me wrong. I like my daughter-in-law and I want her to be happy. But she's not helping. She's pushing her husband to other women. She's not being a good woman to her husband. I think I understand you now. You want us to tell our friend to stop being a bad wife to her husband so that your son will stop cheating on her. Is that what you want us to do? Not exactly. I want you girls to help me beg her to leave my son alone. She's not a good woman. She should stop going around pretending to be good when she's the one making her husband to cheat. Ma, you're supposed to be advising your son to stop cheating. Not the other way around. Oh, come on, Norma. You keep getting it wrong. So because Cindy is our friend, we can't even look at her face and tell her the truth, right? Let me tell you this. When a man is misbehaving or cheating on the wife, it's actually the woman's fault. Thank you, my daughter. Mm -hmm. You see, Cindy, Cindy doesn't love my son at all. She just won that title, married woman. That's why she doesn't take care of her home. The Cindy that I know loves her family dearly. And she's the woman that any man can ever think of having. <laughs> You guys know that Cindy can be very, very mischievous sometimes. You know that. Belinda. Belinda what? Come on. You guys are so naive. You don't even know what's going on in our world today. Listen, let me tell you. Mama was very, very right. Mama, forget these girls. They shouldn't even have been in this conversation in the first place. They call. Give her more sleepless nights. It's better she doesn't know about this. I don't know. Why would that woman be supporting her cheating son and blaming it on the innocent Cindy? I'm not surprised. You know that woman has a very questionable character. Cindy is a wife that any man could ever ask for. I just pray God gives her a child to take care of a lot of things. But what I don't know is that. Why on earth would that woman be supporting a cheating son? My dear, How? I don't even want to talk about this again, I beg. Where is Belinda? What's she still doing inside? Let's wait and find out what exactly she's doing inside. Okay, let's go. I still need your help. I need you to make your friends dislike her. And you have to get my son on tape, pants down. I will pay. No, 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 mama. That won't be so easy to achieve. Having your son pants down? No, mama. You know I'm his wife's friend. That won't be so possible to just achieve it. Please, mama. Why don't we maybe just um, hire another girl to do that? I have hired so many girls. He keeps rejecting them. He doesn't want any girl that comes for him. I think he likes hunting for his women. That's the word, Mama. 
you actually know your son he cheats a lot that's the word hunting he's such a hunter and you know he likes to <laughs> catch his own meat mm, by himself you know him very well <laughs> but not to worry he slept with somebody i wanted him to marry and from the look of things, she might be pregnant. Huh? How? Who was that? The girl was ovulating when he slept with her. Yes, her name is Sandra. She's from a wealthy home. Once the pregnancy is confirmed, I'll send Sydney out of that house, and Sandra will be there. Hmm. No, 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 Mama. I think that might be a little bit extreme. And let me tell you. People might actually frown at that. And again, your son, Nathan. I don't think he would like me to do that. Who cares? Just leave everything to me. I will handle it. <sighs> okay. If you say so. I will be on my way then. Please take it easy, ma'am. Okay then. Take care. Thank you. I know Belinda. She can't keep this information to herself. She'll go and tell that witch and everywhere will turn upside down. Please, you guys should leave me alone, okay? Everybody's entitled to their opinion. Oh, please, before you think or act, just think about yourself. Stop being insensitive and selfish. Me, being insensitive? Yes. So now it's my fault that Nathan is cheating on Cindy, right? Now it's my fault. You blame me for that, right? Belinda, nobody is blaming you. But all we are saying is you should stop supporting that woman. Supporting so which woman now? Which I'm woman? There. I'm not supporting her. Please, please. I'm not supporting that woman. I'm not supporting anybody now. I think we should tell our friend the truth. Because as we speak, I think her husband actually slept with somebody who might possibly be pregnant as we speak. Who told you that? Who told me that? It's Madame Vero. Anyway, this lady's name is Sandra and they actually did it during her ovulation. And the peak of the entire story is that they did it wrong. That can't happen. That's not possible. Uh, that can happen. It already happened, my dear. Anyway, are you coming in the car with me or not? Don't bother about us. We'll find our way. so wicked. Belinda and her mischievous character should not be our concern now. But this allegation that Nathan went into another woman unprotected should be. If you really believe that, then you can believe anything. I don't believe it. It's a lie. He can't do that. I'm telling you, he can't. You see, at first I didn't want to tell you. But then I thought about it, I felt it's actually better to tell you so you prepare yourself, yes, There's okay? nothing to prepare myself for. I'm sorry he can't. I don't believe it. Take it easy, take it easy, Cindy. I know what I'm saying. Do you know what? This is the handwork of my mother in law She's always wanted me to leave this house. She wants me to get upset, pack my things and leave. Are you sure? Are you sure? You know, men are not to be trusted. Please, don't ignore my advice. Belinda, my husband cannot cheat on me. I'm sorry, I don't believe it. He can't. Anyway, I've played my part as a friend who really loves you. But if you choose to ignore my advice and continue loving a Casanova blindly, then you have yourself to blame if you eventually contract any of these deadly diseases. Don't say I didn't warn you. Is wrong. My heart is yours. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. My morning star. The air I breathe. Don't leave me. Why? Why don't is this happening to me? My love is wrong. My heart is yours. Don't leave me. Please. Don't
Don't leave me My morning star The air I believe Don't leave me Don't leave me I'll be more Old Germania The voices that are speaking And I hope will be true Jesus, hey, Haka Akaya, Haka Jehovah, Nemema, hey, Jesus, the Lord is my provider, Jehovah Jireh, hey, what is it, what is it, what, 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 my darling, I had a dream, I had a dream, okay. and the dream was so real, you know how my dreams come out, it comes out the way it happened, the way I dreamt it, I know, hey, praise I know. the Lord, my God and my Lord, you are my provider. I will always worship you. I thank you and I praise you. Sweetheart. You are the God of justice. You are the God of love. You are the God of... Stop, you're shouting. Hmm. What, is, what is this dream about? I'm telling you, it was too real. Well, tell me what the dream is about. Now, what do you, you walk me on? So, in that dream... Yes. I saw you carrying a bouncing baby boy. He was so cute. And he was your child. It's just that I, I wasn't the one carrying him. It was another woman. And, and I, I couldn't recognize her face. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. The Lord has done it. Praise the Lord. My Lord and my God. You said you would never forsake me. You are the God of Abraham and Sarah. And you have done it for me. Baby, hmm? are you not happy? Are you not happy for us? You should be happy. I'm happy. I'm very... Um, I share Good. your excitement. Join me. Will, Join me in praising you, the you Lord. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Hey. Thank you. Thank you very much, God. Hey. My dreams have finally come true. We will finally hear a cry of a baby in this house. Oh, I'm finished, I'm finished, I'm finished. What did I do? Huh? So this girl is pregnant? How? how? How do I face my wife? Why would I allow myself to fall for something like this? I am finished. I'm finished, I'm finished. Ah, oh, never. What happened? Is everything all right? Why are you here this early? Listen, Mom, I have come to tell you specifically that I'm not going to accept any child from anybody except the one that my wife Cindy gives to me. So please, tell your candidate, Sandra, to get rid of that thing that she's carrying, for I will not accept it. Are you insane? You woke me up, no greeting. Is this what you came to my house to tell me? Good morning, Mom. However, I have said what I said and I stand by it. Okay? Your hired killers are not going to kill me before my time, Mom. You all should just leave me alone. Leave me be. No one should activate this beast in me. Because if that happens, you all will have to live with the consequences, Mom. Your wife sent you to me? She didn't send me here, Mom. I've come to have a conversation. You, and I'd rather we keep it this way. Now oh, listen and listen, God. There are no hired killers. Nobody's killing anyone. If you forget everything, 
You better not forget this. I'm, I'm a man I can I pray for peace of mind. You can't do anything. Just get ready to receive your first child. <laughs> Good morning, Mom. My baby, how are you doing? I am doing well. So, tell me, how is it going? Have you checked? But to know if you're pregnant. Mommy, it's, it's too early. I have not checked. It's not too early, my dear. Go to the hospital and check. Or you want me to send the doctor to you? I'll do that if that's what you want. There is no need, Mom. I can go by myself. I will go by tomorrow. Please. Very well, then. I'll be waiting. yourself together okay it's not the end of the world everything is going to be fine <laughs> fine how how will everything be fine what did i do you didn't do anything it's not your fault you can't blame yourself it's his fault for not sticking his stuff at the place all i ever did was to love him i love him with everything that i have Let's just pray that the Sandra girl is not pregnant, okay? What did I do? It's alright. What have I done to deserve it's this? It's okay. It's okay, don't be like this, please. It's okay. It's alright. Okay. It's alright. Drop, drop that one here. Drop it here. Thank you. Thank you. You can go. Hi, husband. How are you? I'm okay. Mm. What's your baby? Those are baby things, right? Yes. What's going on? I, I didn't want to be caught unawares. I'm preparing for the baby that is coming into this family. Don't play with me now. Don't play with me now. What's this? Are you saying that we're respecting and this is your way of telling me that, we're, 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 that no. you're pregnant? No, I'm not pregnant. I'm talking about your baby, Nathan. Your baby that is coming into this family. You just used the word stupid on me, and it appears that I am actually indeed very stupid. I mean, how can I be expecting a, a, a baby when I'm not pregnant? Oh, no, you tell me, because you tell me, because you're the one who's carrying baby stuff around. So tell me. No, tell me. no, you tell me, Nathan. Are you pregnant with vital information that I should know? What are you talking about? You know what? Nah. I'm not ready for this drama. My love is strong. My heart is yours. Don't leave me. Please, don't leave me. My morning star. The air I breathe. Don't leave me. Yes, I like it. I'll do anything. Anything at all to, to, to make you happy, Cindy. Anything. Is there something you want to tell me? Yes, my love. Okay. 
Go ahead. I'm listening. I want you to know that you're my life. You're my everything. And that no matter what happens, always have it in mind that he loves you. Because I love you. With every part of me, no matter what happens, always remember this. Today. I love you. Are you afraid of something happening? No. No. I mean, you started telling me what happened in the village before I left for the village or when I left for the village. And, and, and you stopped. I, I want you to tell me exactly what happened. Tell me. Tell me so that I would know. Please. Nathan, please just tell me. Talk to me. Tell me. Tell me exactly what happened. I, I want to know. Miss you? Uh, Want to spend time with you? Okay, this is serious. What? I mean, I wasn't complaining. So I haven't said you're complaining. I'm just saying that I'm, you know, I kind of miss our times together in the evening, chill, you know. Yeah. You know, you know how you should just um, see the evening and stuff. Where's my husband and what have you done with him? Nothing. I'm right here. Oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. Besides, there's this uh, movie I'd like for you and I to see this evening. Mm. Yeah, you know, just kill the lights and just have a moment, just be on the floor. Okay, there. okay, okay. You okay. know how it gets. I'll be right back. Wearing our briefs and stuff. Let me go change you know, into something that more type, comfortable. That type of movie, you know. That oh, God. That type of movie. Oh. You want to change? It's yes. Nice. Can I come with you? No. Okay. Let me come with you. I said no. No. Let me, let me no, help you change. No, sit. Put on the movie. Put the movie on. Put the movie on. Okay. Ben. Sorry. I'm here. Right here. Love you, baby. Love you too. So, this is why you're looking at me like that. Where are you rushing to? Home. Rushing home. To spend some quality time with my wife. Yeah? See, see, my baby is coming and she's actually coming with a friend. If you see her picture, she's just your spec. Let me show you. What do you know my spec to be? Boy, relax. My wife is the only spec that I need right now. Eh? Don't get me into trouble. Bigo, 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 bigo. Wrap them up now. Hmm? Uh -huh. Please. <laughs> what well, eh? Spend some quality time with my wife. Come on, you you don't understand. Like, what is going on with you? I'm in a happy place. That's what. I love my wife. That's what. The drink up before I leave you here. <laughs> so you carried your two left leg into my shop to come and collect money. You want me to pay you? Pay you for what? Why should I pay you? Hey, madam, I, don't, I didn't just see a shop and I decided to walk in. Yes, I did a job for you, so I'm here to get paid. So where is the picture you're supposed to get for me? I, I, I tried. I did everything possible, but he refused to comply. So why do you want me to pay you? You couldn't get the picture. Why do you want me to pay you? For the job. Which job? It's an agreement. What agreement? What nonsense agreement? We agreed you get me the picture. You didn't get me the picture. And you're here to collect money. Are you crazy? It's an agreement. Money. Before I open my eyes, just disappear from this place. Get out! Pay me my money. Because I will always come back and fight my money. That's it. Look at this riffraff. 
You think you can threaten a woman like me? If I deal with you, I swear you go disappear. Oh, really? Come and get out from here. All right. I'll I'll think get out. I will soon come back. How dare you? See this one, monkey. You're coming to threaten me. Are you crazy? Come on to get me a picture. You can't even get me the picture. You think I'm a woman you can threaten? How dare you? In that poala? Nonsense. Simple job, you couldn't even do it. You have yet to come and ask for money. Telling me it's an agreement. Rubbish. Let me see you here again. Nonsense. We have not even arranged for where the baby will stay. What? Hmm? I don't know what you're talking about. Please, can I just sleep? Please? No, no, just tell me. What room are we going to arrange for the baby that is coming? So, can we talk about this tomorrow? I need to sleep. I will let you sleep if you answer me this one question. What is it? What question? What room? What room are we going to arrange for the baby that is coming? Huh? Well, can this not waste you tomorrow? Please, can we not talk about it tomorrow, please? If you answer me, you will sleep. You know what? Next room, all right? The next, the next room. The next one. So mm. by this answer, you are confirming that indeed you are expecting a baby? What? Ah! Don't be upset. Sleep. Don't be upset, my handsome husband. See? But I was sleeping and no, you no, woke no, me no, up. No, no, don't be upset. Listen, this is a family and as a unit, we must we must, we must find solutions to our problems and answers to our questions. That's all I'm trying to find out. Eh? And since I am not pregnant, it means that somebody else is pregnant. Ah, I don't know who that is. I mean, you, you, you woke me up, so you should be telling me what's going on. You no, woke me up. No, you were already telling me the story. Just finish it. What happened during that period? Tell me. Don't be upset. Eh? Really, baby? Really? out there, go for one of them and leave me alone, or give me... Calm down, okay? You shouting. Take it easy. Take it easy? I've been trying to take it easy with you, but this single act of you coming to my workplace shows that you and all the men are agents of the devil, trying to take me out of my husband's house. Tell them you did not see me. Tell them you did not see me. Come on, stop. I don't like what you're saying. Stop. It has not gotten to that. Mm. Wait. I know what you might be thinking. But believe me, I'm not in this with anyone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. The next time I see you around me, I will get you arrested. Arrested? For what? For expressing myself to you? Come on. Why are you acting this way? Okay. I just want us to be friends. Which friends? Inunugu na muke na mwai na boy. Inugia. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I am a married woman. Leave me alone. Friend, kill you there. I love you. Lo love, kill you there. Love, kill you there. Nonsense, don't you? But I love you. Love, why give up? I will always be there for you. What can love kill you there? I will do anything for you. Do for yourself, you promise. I will even take care of you. Please, just give me a chance. Just more, please. What eventually happened? Help my wife. Hmm? Yes, baby. You are becoming too nice these days. What do you want? Well, I'm here to remind you how much I love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is your niceness. Almost like the very first time we met at the university. Mm. 
Like that time when we met and I swept you with your feet. Huh? <laughs> hmm? Memories that could last me a lifetime. Which is why I'm wondering why the sudden change. Have a told you lately that I love you. <laughs> hmm? And I love you too. I'm just about to you. I love you. Now watch me make you the most amazing meal today. Nah, you're the real meal. It's okay. You can go to the room now. Right now, just give me some. Okay, go watch go watch your movies. Babe, don't give me some. I'm already here now. Don't... I said leave. Babe, you're stingy these days. Your right? wall has become too much these days. Why are you go. why are you hurting? Hurting what? Nah, babe. Go. Give me one mouth. I said go. So, just kill it, just kill it, just kill it. I'm surprised you're saying this. There's nothing wrong with what I've said. Talk to that girl. Let her go for a test. That way we know the situation. I'm, I'm dying slowly. I'm worried. Instead of you to be praying for this test to be positive, you're here talking nonsense. To what end, mom? If it's positive, to what end? What would happen? I'm not going to marry her. If it's positive, tell her to get rid of it. That was a mistake. She knows and I know too. That, that, that singular act was a mistake. Yes? You are a liar. She will never do such a thing and you will marry her. I'm married, mom. What am I going to marry two women? That's not going to happen now. She has to get rid of it. And mom, look, see, I see where you're going with this. Stop trying to separate me and my wife. It won't happen. You are a joker. You're married. Which marriage? Please say something else. As long as I'm concerned, my son is not married. How come? What happened? I thought you were overlating when it happened. Yes, mom, I was overlating. I am very sure of that. Oh. What sort of bad luck is this? Mom, are you sure the son is fatal at all? I can impregnate him. My son is very fertile. Is that which he married? I'm, I'm a man I can't anymore. I pray for peace of mind. Amen the more, amen the no more. Peace of mind. Are you not going to tell me what's going on? I'm your wife. I know something has been bothering you this past few weeks, even though you pretend nothing is bothering you. Please tell me. It's nothing. Are you sure? Yes, babe. I don't think so. Babe. Look, babe, I... I, I said, babe, I... I did something that I'm really not proud of. And I'm hoping that you can forgive me. Please. I hope that you 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 find it in your heart. Huh. It's your mom. Yeah, I know, I know, no, no, no. I'm not. Uh, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not picking. Since when did you stop picking your mom's call? Huh. My mom is drama. It's, I, I'm not taking that call. Please now. pick. <laughs> you know my no-nonsense mother-in-law, Madame Vero. Please pick that call. In fact, call her back. Sweetheart, I'm not taking the call. Let it be. I'm serious. Honestly, I don't want problems. Okay, no, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Better. Take it. Oh, yeah. I'll take it. I'm a man I can't anymore. I pray for peace of mind. Amen the more, the more, the more. Peace of mind. Mom, yeah. Are you serious? <laughs> yes, I'm happy. <laughs> she got the light. Ah! 
<laughs> You're going to tell me something. What? You're going to tell me something before the phone rang. Ah, oh, babe. Babe. Mm. Talk to me now. Babe. I was just playing with you. I, I wasn't going to say anything. I was just, I mean, you were worried that I was worried. So I decided to play along. That's it. Nothing really. Aren't you ever going to tell me what's going on? Babe, hey, what? Someone cannot play with you anymore. Uh, relax, Joe. There's that really nothing. I'm fine. What did she say? Trust me, nothing. What did she say? Oh, she was just being dramatic. Peek, peek. Yeah. What does this one want now? Just to gossip, that's all. Why is she not picking now? Huh? <sighs> Please, I don't need any bad vibes in my life right now. at me like that. This is my house as well and I'm here to set things right. Carry my things into the room. My room. You know my room. Yes. That one I like to stay. Take my bags in there. Are you sure you know my room? Welcome mom. I'm, I'm a man I can't I pray for peace of mind. Even the more, the more, peace of mind. I'm, I'm a man I can't I pray for peace of mind. Man, I 
like animal, I pray for peace of mind. Amen to more, amen to no more. This, this is this is what this is value for. Why, why is she doing this? This is so unfair, I swear. I'm not going anywhere. What did you say? I'm not going anywhere. Listen, you know anywhere. the mother, she's already boiling that water. Get up, let's go. What this is unfair now? What in my own house again? See, huh? This one is this one is not about house now. Get up, let's go. Father Lord, we thank you. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we exalt you. Lord. Heavenly God, our Father. Lord, help us. Help us in this house. Help us in this family. Lord, help us to open every eye that has been blocked by the demon. Lord, every eye that the, our enemy has blocked that they will not see. Lord, help us to open those eyes. Whatever, from the east, from the west, from the north, every satanic demon that has blocked anybody in this house to see what is blocking his success. I come against it in the name of Jesus. I come against every setback in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Hmm? Say amen. amen. I'm praying you are sleeping. Oh, amen. Do you have one year better? Lord, I call upon you. I call upon you. Whatever that is covering my my household, whatever that is covering my son, whatever that is make, draw him, draw him backward, backward, backward. For him not to see success. For him not to succeed. Holy Ghost! Holy Ghost! Fire. Get up. Hallelujah. Are you not sleeping? Mm-mm. I'm praying you're sleeping. Nobody's saying amen. Nobody's saying blood of Jesus. Amen, blood of Jesus. Amen, blood of Jesus. Amen. 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 Good morning, Mama. Good morning, Mama. Mama, good morning. Pretender. Pretender. Keep pretending. Very soon, your secret will be exposed and my son will know exactly who you are. Mama, even my enemies give it to me. I am a straightforward person. I have no secrets. You think I don't know you used to do to hold my son? Uh -uh. I know. But let me tell you something. We will start midnight prayer in this house. You know how powerful midnight prayer can be. Mama, I am a God child will of God. You I am and a my child son will of be free. God, Mama. I am a child of God. I have never touched Juju. A <laughs> Zilko, a child of God that doesn't pray. A child of God indeed. Ah. I am from a background. And that background, I was taught that before you kneel down to pray, God already knows what your problems are. We pray silently. And, and for all we know, Mama, God is not deaf. Mm. I understand the insult. Don't worry. Very soon. Oh no. Very soon. I'm, I'm a man I can't anymore. I pray for peace of mind. Even the more demands and all the more peace of mind. What is keeping her now? I'm hungry. Uh-uh. Food will soon be here now. Because she's too lazy. Cooking is taking her the whole day. I'll take it easy. I go now, go and pick Ah, finally. Yeah. Yeah. You, you need help? No, no, it's fine. You're sure? Yes, I'm You can just pour the water for me. Oh, okay. Because we could serve my own. Ah, finally. I must have just served now. No quantity. Let us have it. Are you going to be chewing banana because you rice? I'll put the banana in the rice. Ha. Oh, can't see. Try it. I mean, you can't soup. Is this enough for me? Please put more food for me. Put more. I said you should put more here. Don't you know I'm hungry? 
after waiting the whole day. What you gonna do? Am I stand now? Please put me from your phone. Is there? So that I'm fine. Just let me just, just say a little bit. Okay. Mama, you're eating already. And you haven't even prayed. But you asked us to pray all the time. And who told you I had not prayed? Well, when did you pray? I prayed in my mind. Hmm? So now let's pray. Holy Father, we thank you for this food. We thank you for providing. We ask, O oh Lord, that you bless the sanctified the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you. Amen. So right now, we need to pray and rebuke the handbook of the devil. Mama, get up, get up, get up. Get up. Leave Mama, me alone, Biko. It's your dream, your sorrow, and your tragedy. Go and pray and leave me alone. Mama, uh, Mama, uh, it's time for prayer. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up, Mama, get up. Get up, there's fire on the mountain. We have to pray. No, Mama does not work like that. We're a unit, we're a family. Eh? You, we cannot just pray something. But what is it they told you? What are you both planning to do? What are you talking about? That I'm confused. I don't know what, what, what I'm doing. What? Mama, we cannot afford for anything to happen to anybody in this house. <laughs> She became this way. You know, my, my mom wasn't this way when I was growing up. Well, they said change is the only constant thing in life. Why it? would she change for the worse? The thing is, I, I regret telling her that I love to pray in silence. You know what I'm going to do? What? I am going to start disturbing her every single day. She says she likes prayers. I will give it to her exactly how she likes it. Let's see what's going to happen. I just want to let her go out. Let, let her go back to the house that I bought her. Let her just go. Let her leave us alone. And let's live here in peace. And you know the only way that's going to happen? What? Is by paying her back in her own coin. Okay, so we'll have to do this again. Fire. 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 Prayer. Fire. Prayer. Fire. You are looking at me as if I have done something wrong. You have done everything. You have just, you have done everything wrong. You are really disappointing me, honestly. Madam, it is not my fault. I tried my best. See, we are up against a woman who would follow you at your own pace and still will not do anything stupid. I don't want to hear all this story. You see all this nonsense you're saying. I'm not interested in all these stories. I'm not interested in it. Let me tell you something. Every woman has a weak point. All you just need to do, use your brain and press the right button. Then get me what I want. Get me these pictures. I know what I did already. This woman is not cheap at all. She is not the kind of woman that one can get by knowing her weak points. Okay, all you're saying is bullshit. Just know that. 
this is what I want you to do now. When I get home, once I call you, you start calling her. You must keep calling her until she picks. That will not be a problem now. That's Martin. I am not giving you another money until you deliver. Me, I no go give you another money until you deliver for me. Mama, no worry. This one now go show. No worry, go show. I mean, they tell you. Go, go well. I'm going home now to go and rest. When I get home, if there's anything I want you to do, I will let you know. Let me have that. So let me have the apple. Hold on. I'll give you this apple on one condition. What condition? Tell me why I should give you this apple rather than eating it. Well, you said that I'm the apple of your eye. I am the apple. You said, baby, you are the apple of my eye. So meaning I'm the apple here. You are not even serious. But I'm serious. <laughs> Listen, there's more than 10 apples in the fridge. No, I want this one. Why? Why? Why is this one? Why is this one so important to you? I'm this. not going to give it to you. I will walk. I will walk here to the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can we share this one? No, I'm not sharing. <laughs> Your monitoring spirit is tired. <laughs> she was monitoring you, huh? Then she's in for a long wait. She wait from now to the kingdom come. You're bracing up, I like. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, listen, I want you to call her now. Keep calling her until she peaks. When she peaks, sound very romantic to her. And make sure you make her sound romantic to you as well. Call her right now, right away. Now that you ate this apple with me, are you satisfied now? I'm happy because we, we had it together. We ate it together. Hmm. But you don't want to take it? No, I don't want to. It's not important. You never know. <laughs> Trust me, it's not important and I don't want any distractions. I'm spending quality time with my pay. Babe, the person keeps calling. Seriously. <laughs> Person keeps it coming. I know, but trust me, it's not important at all. It's not. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you say so. Since when have you started keeping secrets from your husband? Oh no, mom, 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 mom. Open your eyes and see. Why is she not picking that call? Who is calling you? It's a call. Either take it or not take it. Sweetheart, are you keeping something from me? No. Are you asking her? If you're not keeping any secret from him, why are you not answering that call? Who is calling you? Who is calling you? It's not important, trust me. It's just a friend. A friend that your husband doesn't know. Sweetheart, you know what? Just, just pick the call, okay? Trust me, it's not important, honestly. Uh, is he one of your boyfriends? What? I don't have any boyfriend. Oh, yes, you do. Ah. If you don't have a boyfriend, pick that call. I'm a man I can't move. I pray for peace of mind. Amen. The more, the more, the more, the more peace of mind. I'm a man I can't move. I pray for peace of mind. By the time I'm done with you, you will leave this house without a pain. I told you before, it's, it's a guy. He was asking me out and, and, and I said and said no. I said I was not interested. No, so now he's no longer a friend. He's now a guy. What does this guy want? Nothing. Huh? Believe me, I don't have anything to do with him. I told him I was married, but he just wouldn't stop. You had nothing to do with this guy. Or had no intention of cheating on me with this guy. How come? Not even for once. Did you mention him to me? How come you never talked about him? But I did. I, I mentioned him to you. I just didn't give you specific details because I didn't think he was important. I, I didn't take him serious. You didn't take him seriously, yet he calls your phone. While I'm sitting there, you refuse to take the call. Why? 
I didn't take his call because, obviously, he has nothing important to say. I love you. I, I can't even imagine myself having anything to do with any other guy. You should know the woman that you married. And you should know the type of men who lurk around these days. They're not even scared of the word marriage anymore. When a woman starts to give attention or start listening, that's where the problem lies. you the truth. I love you. I, I love you, Nathan. I can't have anything to do with anyone. I can't cheat on you. Yet, you did a great job. <laughs> I must commend you. But I need more of that. I need you to send her a love text narrating an epic sex you both had. I know, I know you didn't have sex with her, I know. Just send her the text. I will tell you when to send the text. No, no, not now. I will still call you again. Okay then, thank you. I'm a man I can't anymore. I pray for peace of mind. Amen the more, the man's a no the more peace of mind. I'm a man I can't anymore. Why are you still awake by this time? I'm waiting for Nathan. You mean he's not back yet? He's not. So why are you still waiting for him? Why don't you go inside and sleep? No, I want to be here when he when he returns. I you want to be here? Why? What for? I want to see him. You see, you women. You women are the reason why men take you for granted. You see his father. He respected me a lot because I don't give him the chance to ride me. Go inside and go and sleep. He's not a kid. He will come back. Oh, please, I'm not ready to sleep. I don't feel like sleeping. I'm not sleepy at all. Then go out. Go inside. Dress well. Dress nice. Go to the club. Go and have fun. Mama. Don't mama me. Mama. Don't mama me. That is the only way to be happy. If not, you will stay here, you will have heart attack, and you will die premature. Oh, mama, please, I can't do that. I can't even imagine myself in a club right now. Okay. Stay and be waiting for him now. Husband and wife lack decency and morals. Look at the time you're coming back, 1.30 a.m. Oh, not tonight. I'm tired. Not tonight. Don't shut me up, Biko. See how you want to use your hand to destroy your own home. Now it's beginning to affect your wife. <laughs> wife, can we not talk about my wife tonight? You should you come back by 1.30, she comes back by 1 a.m. Hold on. Are you saying my wife is not home at this, at this time? She just got back by 1 a.m. You're coming back by 1.30 1, 1 a.m. She just got back. She went out. See, so koto. You need to see what she was wearing. She was dressed like a prostitute. Oh, you can She just got back by one a.m. and you're coming in by one thirty a.m. What is going on? Okay. She just got in, and you are walking in. For peace of mind, even the more the males are no the more peace of mind. Have you suddenly forgotten how it feels when everyone expects you as a woman to come through with a child and it's not happening yet? No one humiliated you like this, no one called you barren, mom. I don't think so. So please 
Stop. Because you can't stop if you want to stop, Mom. My wife is not barren. See, let me tell you. That emotional blackmail will work on me. No, it won't work. Your father was not the only son. He has other siblings that their children can continue their lineage. Your case is different. You are my only son. 